Evaluate exponential functions. If f of x equals to 5 to the power of 3 minus x, then find, we have two questions here, part a is 2 times f of 3 and part b is f of 1 plus x times f of 1 minus x. So we will do these two parts one by one. Let's start with part a which is 2 times f of 3. I hope you remember function notations. We'll apply function notations to evaluate 2 f of 3, right? So when we say 2 times f of 3, that, that really means 2 times value of function at x equals to 3. That's, that is f of 3, right? So function for us is 5 to the power of 3 minus x. When we say f of 3, you have to substitute x as 3, right? So this really means, this means you have to substitute x equals to 3 for the function, right? This is what it means. So let's do that. So 2 times, let me put brackets here, 5 to the power of 3 minus, and instead of x, I'm writing 3. So this is, this is what it means, correct? Now, 2 times 5 to the power of 3 minus 3 is 0. And anything to the power of 0 is just 1, right? It is just 1. So we get times 1 and therefore we get a solution as 2. So 2 times f3 for the given function f of x equals 2, 5 to the power of 3 minus x is 2. So that is our solution or rather the value of the function at this function that's the value of the given function. Now let's see part b. In part b we have f of 1 plus x times f of 1 minus x. So that really means that we'll substitute instead of x 1 plus x get the first part and then we'll substitute 1 minus x and get the next part right. So let's do that. So when we say f of 1 plus x that means this function let me put them in bracket first function is 5 to the power of 3 minus instead of x I have to write 1 plus x so I'll write 1 plus x right so this is f of 1 plus x do you understand now f of 1 minus x will be replacing x with 1 minus x so it is 5 to the power of 3 minus 1 minus x and their product correct so let's kind of simplify this and then we'll multiply so we have 5 to the power of let's open the bracket 3 minus 1 is 2 minus and plus becomes negative so it becomes 2 minus x times here we have 3 minus 1 is indeed 2 and minus and minus becomes plus so we have 2 plus x now we're trying to multiply two exponential functions with the same base. The base is 5, so applying the rules, their exponents will get added up. So let's add them up. So we get 2 minus x plus 2 plus x, right? And that gives us 5 to the power of 2 plus 2 is 4, right? So we get 5 to the power of 4 and minus x plus x is 0. So we are left with 5 to the power of 4, right? 5 square is 25, so now we get the answer, which is 25 times 25, or you can use the calculator. So the answer becomes 625 for us, correct? So that is how we can get the answer for the given question, right? So we have evaluated both the functions, and these are the steps which should be followed to evaluate. I hope the steps are absolutely clear. Just go through them once again and then try similar questions. I hope you appreciate it. Thank you and all the best.